how to format Google Docs like a book. So first thing is head over to File, which is located on the upper left corner of your screen. Then go to Page Setup. Now under Orientation, select Portrait, and in Paper Size, it should be Letter, which is 8.5 by 11. And all of these margins should be set to 1 inch. And then click OK. Now the commonly used font style when creating or writing a manuscript is Times New Roman. So click this, which is font, click the drop down arrow button, and select Times New Roman. Now the font size should be 12, so just click this icon to increase your font size. Onto the first line of the cover page, it should consist of your first and last name as well as the word count. To know your word count, all you have to do is go to Tools, click Word Count. In this section, you will know your word count. So you can tick the box beside Display Word Count while typing and then click OK so that your word count will be presented in this area. Now create another line for your address and another line for your city, state, and zip code and for your email address. Make sure that the email address that you will be putting is working and that you are currently accessing it. Now at the center of the cover page should be the manuscript title written in capital letters and the author's name. Now to insert a new page, make sure that the cursor is after the last word and then go to insert, head over to break, and then select page break, which will insert a new page. Now on the upper portion of this page should consist your last name and then the manuscript title and on the right part should be the page number. So to insert a page number, all you have to do is go to insert, head over to page numbers and select the second option. Then on the center is the chapter number and then the chapter title. Or you can also place the chapter number on top of the page. And so that is how you format Google Docs like a book. Thank you and have a great day.